Hey guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you some quick tips as to how I make more realistic looking horses. So let's just get right into it. The first tip I have is to use nature tones or add brown tints to your colors. This makes the horse look a little bit more like it's actually been outside because horses aren't like totally industrial white every time. Or if they're a black horse, they're not always 100% Vanta black. So sometimes it's nice to add a little bit of brown to those tones and make them look a little bit more natural, a little bit more like they are on an animal that's been outside in the dirt. And it sounds counterintuitive to make the horse look uglier by adding brown to it or making it look dirty, but it actually makes it look a lot more like the real deal, which is what matters in games. Sometimes in games, the horses look so perfect that they can't possibly be real. So add a little bit of nature tones to them to make them seem a little bit more like they belong. My next tip to you guys is to research horse colors. Horse genetics are really helpful to know, even just small things like knowing which coats make the hooves tan and which ones make the hooves darker makes a big difference. Making up horse colors that don't exist might save you time, but it's really unrealistic and cheap looking. My next tip for you guys is to use images and decals correctly. Some decals can look a lot better if they're transparent or if they're made into a texture, so it's important not to just slap them on and deal with it. Some looks can be achieved more easily without decals, like stockings. My fourth tip for you guys is to write an accurate bio for the horse. This ideally includes the age, temperament, breed, color, and where the horse came from, whether it was a rescue or it was adopted or some other similar situation. Look at the bios of your different horses closely to make sure they don't all sound the same. Not every horse should be a wild black stallion. Add some nuance and make your horses stand out from other games. If other games are making a lot of really calm Icelandic horse jumpers, for example, try making some flighty dressage thoroughbreds. My final and probably the most important tip that I have for you guys is to use reference photos of real horses. Reference photos make the horse look true to life. And just because you know what horses look like from seeing them doesn't mean it's not helpful to analyze a photo and take note of the exact colors and patterns. This is also really useful if you've never tried tip number two, researching the horse colors before, because copying what a photo looks like instead of trying to come up with a brand new look for the horse makes it look so much more realistic, saves you so much time, and it's really great that we have the ability to just Google a picture of a horse and be able to make it look exactly like it looks in real life. So go and take advantage of that and use it so that your games can look more realistic. So that's the last tip I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any more tips for other people who are trying to learn or if you have any questions um, and go forth and enjoy the rest of your day.